Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode. Uh, we're just out at uh, Buckout Location 2 as I've dubbed it now. Uh, this is going to be my place for uh, doing a lot of bushcraft stuff, camping out and whatnot. Uh, you know, nobody's using it so I'm claiming it. But uh, we got Big Blue back here and uh, I gotta say one of the great points of this little rise as you can see, this this way is chained. There's there's no way to get through back there. You couldn't get a truck back there. And uh, this way, uh, nothing short of an FJ or a Jeep or a four-wheeler is getting up that and bang me. Because I'm going to tell you, it is spooky ookie dookie. But uh, what we're going to do right now is uh, I've bugged out, uh, stopped by a local station and grabbed some food items as fast as I could and got the hell out of Dodge. So... Uh, I'm looking to make me some po' boys, and I'm also looking at a way to uh, keep my cooking fire and heat source low profile night. So what I'm going to be looking to do here shortly is turn that pile of concrete chunks into something like a rocket stove or a wood stove. So okay, by. Just, just bear with me. It's a little janky at the moment, but I'm certain, that I, be I believe in myself, I can make this thing into something Okay, useful. guys. Here it is, final product. It's not a rocket stove. I uh, found that a little bit difficult to, you know, you know, using these odd shaped chunks of stone and whatnot. But um, apparently that used to be someone's like drives way or part of a building or something. Well, I mean, it was just in a pile of smash back there. But uh, put it together to create something that I can, you know, set a pan on or uh, just have out here in case I need it. And uh, the idea there is the road is that way. And so I want to eliminate the light signature uh, that's that's being broadcast in this direction, and uh, redirect some of that heat back toward me, so I can just you know put a chair in front of it, park the bug out vehicle next to it, and make camp. So let's uh, since I am getting starving, let's go ahead and uh, see what I brought along to eat. All right. Get this fired up. Excellent. Excellent. Excellent spitters. But uh, yeah, that appears to be working real well keeping the fire going in one direction you know it's not it's it's windy out right now so it's it's acting as a great wind break uh fire went right up with some of that punk wood i mean i didn't even barely have to do anything to it and pretty soon we'll start feeding bigger stuff in get the temperatures up maybe a couple of fresh hickory chunks see where that gets us but uh okay. it's after boy, a short run it's uh, a little stubborn at first with that punk wood but i got it running and uh, apparently i made it just high enough because uh, those flames don't seem to be licking very far above that Top brim. So, uh, mission successful. Let's get to cooking. Okay, so uh, now that that's going good, you remember that ration kit from the back of the FJ? Yeah. Let's get Poe boying. Juice is all getting going. Oh, I'm burning that a little bit. Move that back a tad. A tad touch. Nope. The stick's being uncooperative. Okay, that's close enough. That's where we're going. Okay. So as that's finishing up, um, we're getting there. That sausage just says to heat it to 165, so it's just getting about there. Nice little brown on it. Uh, a little bit of toasted on the bread. And uh, we're about to be good to go with a uh, open face, uh, po' boys, a little lettuce, uh, cut that sausage in half, a little lettuce, a little mayo, a little sliced tomato, and we're gonna be okay. chowing and down. And finally, sweet, sweet success. And uh, that thing was a success too. I, I like that, man. I can come out here anytime I want now. I know I'll have wood. You should just bring my hatchet next time, but. Uh, yeah, and then I got thinking, you know, I should have thought bring a plate and all this. And, you know, we're bugging out. We'll work with what we're doing, you know. In uh, future reference, I might put some uh, cookware and stuff in the uh, FJ just in case I have to do something like this again. But, uh, yeah. Thumbs up. Rundown was a success. Test run is good. <sighs> starting to cool off out now. I'm getting a little windy. I'm just fine. Ooh, I need to plug that little hole right there. Good thing I caught that. But it's the little things, people. The little things that are the best. <laughs> 